four girls in Hamilton County made national history. They are some of the first ever female Eagle Scouts. Channel 3's Angela Kim has more on the legacy they hope to leave. So when I found out that, you know, they're finally letting girls in, I thought, well, that's perfect, you know, just in time. She came to me and she was like, hey, guess what's happening? I know you like this. Annika Pierce, Rowan Kolajek, Lottie Miller, and Bethany Ostheim decided to take their girl power to the next level and become Eagle Scouts. I was always tagging along with my brothers since they were in Cub Scouts. There were just three of us to begin with, and I was the oldest, so I, I guess, kind of gravitated towards those leadership roles. But it's definitely been, I guess, a little bit of extra pressure because it's... I'm one of the first Girl Eagle Scouts. They all say the experience is rewarding, especially when it comes to using their new status as Eagle Scouts to give back to the community. It was a great moment to see something like that emotion come out of something that we made. Seeing some of the changes that I've implemented in my troop and some of the precedents that I've set and how they're impacting the other girls and allowing them to have a more fun experience. They say they hope to use their new accomplishments to help other girls moving forward and inspire them to always push boundaries. Just not to be shy and just be who you are. I feel like we've all surprised a lot of people and, you know, showed them that it doesn't matter for a girl, whatever you are. Get into things that a lot of people don't think that you could do and just kind of prove them wrong anyway. Focus on your goals and know that if you work hard enough, you can achieve them. Reporting in Chattanooga, Angela Kim, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Miller says the number of girls who want to become an Eagle Scout has now more than doubled. 13 girls in her troop hope to become Eagle Scouts.